Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with Seven Days to Die, and it is Horde Day. Once it reaches nighttime, the Horde will come, the Blood Moon will rise, and everything gets ugly. But yeah, we've got to start getting things ready to go over there and prepare for that Horde. I'm not sure what all we're going to need. Probably need some repair kits. Probably not a bad idea. If something happens to our weaponry. Let's see. We've got... I uh, don't even know what we'll need, honestly. We're not going to be nearly as prepared as we used to be when I used to play this. Have to take that to the trader eventually. Yeah, I haven't gone to any of the other traders or even looked around at the other towns yet. And there might be some. I can't remember. Do I have to have a. Let me try something here. Do I have to have a workbench to craft iron air? I know I do for the steel. <laughs> Yes, I can craft iron arrows. I'll put some of those in my... I've already had some. I've got plenty of the stone arrows, but I figured the iron ones are going to help me. Let's see. That's something to drink, too, don't I? Grab a little bit of water. How am I doing on food? Not too bad. Yeah, what I'm going to need to do is I'm going to need to take some food with me. I might be able to make some bacon and eggs. Yep, I can make bacon and eggs. That's going to be good, because that's going to... I did make some pumpkin bread. About all I've made so far. <laughs> I'm still very new with the cooking just yet, but... We're getting there, slowly but surely. Eventually I'll be able to make some pretty good stuff. Let's see, I got cornbread here, and I might... Do I have some tuna somewhere? Sure. Let's try the beef rations. I'm just seeing what I can and cannot cook yet. Soup stock. Peas. Don't know what you can cook until you try. That's all. All I know. So we still have eggs in the mix. So we can make pumpkin bread, baked potato, boiled egg, and cornbread. Eh. Well, those aren't all that great. So I think I'm gonna drop all this stuff back off because honestly. can't make anything that great. 
got me some coffee. I got... Let's see. I'm gonna drop off some of the stuff because I don't need it just yet. Brass needs to go with the ammo. Actually, let's go ahead and make... Let's take this clay over to the forge and cook it in. I'm gonna let that go ahead and cook. I've got enough food. It's not a problem. Pick up a building block. Let's go check out our forge. There's our resident chicken. Alright. Got metal still cooking in there. Yep, we can make forged iron. That's good. Yeah, we need more clay. That'll allow us to make more forged iron. Let's see how much we can make. We can make 20. So that's a start. Yeah, I put it out here to kind of attract attention away from my base with the heat signature. So if a screamer would come, I'd have enough time to hear her and get the heck out of Dodge. But what we're going to do is we're going to go over to our little area that we're going to be setting up as a horde base. That was disgusting. That's kind of weird. Just a random fire, huh? Alright. I don't have any bullets for that. That gun, that kind of ticks me off. I also can't find any lock picks. Otherwise I'll go to the police station. So there'd probably be ammo there. There we go. We did it. And that's how we get there. This is going to have to be where we start our first horde night. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Hopefully I can put a storage crate up here. I'm going to give it a try anyway. Storage. Yeah, I want to be able to... Oh, perfect. I want to put all my stuff in here. The food. Coffee. Some water. Repair kits. Bandages might not be a bad idea. <laughs> At least one. Um, some stone arrows. Some ammo there. I don't have that many shotgun shells, unfortunately. Yeah, we're gonna have to make do with what we got. And what we got is not all that great, but we just gotta survive. <laughs> Alright, empty green pickup truck. See if we can't find a, a way in here. There's a truck right here. We can see what's inside it. Okay, we got books. Oh, what the heck? I got a stun baton. These are eh, they're okay. I'm not real, real crazy. Oh. 
That was some serious lag. Is there something around here that I need to be aware of? There's a zombie. Sure. Yep. Thinking I'm got bad news for you guys. inside that trailer. Fire cutters. Getting easier to take these guys out. They're not as tough as they used to be. I'm already getting stronger. I do need to take a drink, though. That's how well my water levels were. All right. Let's see. Anything in here that we can use? Blueberry pie. Very nice. Use some blueberry pie. Here's some ammo pile. Ah! 9mm. Need that. Wish I could find a lot more of that. That pistol is... Need ammo for that pistol. Without a doubt. Anything in here? No. We got another building here. Let's see. More ammo. Yeah, I can't really use that yet. Let's see, we've got leather. I've already got that, that kind of... Shotgun duckbill mod that spreads it out. But up on the tire, that ain't gonna help much. Shotgun shells we can use. There's medicine. Oh, we can always use splints and cats. That's Shotgun Messiah stuff. That's perfect. Oh ho ho! Level 5 pipe pistol. Very nice. I'll have to see what that is. Unlock Shotgun's pipe shotgun quality number 3. That takes us up a step. Well, let's see. How much damage does that do? 33.6. How's this one do? This one still does better. <laughs> and it can do more shots. So we're still better off with the regular pistol. Well, I thought I really found something. Oh well. Eh. It's a stone sledgehammer. It's not the best quality. I've got purple 
<laughs> Much better. Let's see. This we could probably scrap. Can't sell it. Might be able to sell the pipe pistol. So I'm going to hang on to that. Eh. Let's see, is there anything else maybe worthwhile? Just need ammo really bad. Really, really need ammo. Damn, gone it. Feathers. Coffee and stuck a seed. I wish we could crouch and go through holes like we did two years ago. Yeah, I was looking at a video where apparently you can go back on alphas and play old alphas as far back as like alpha eight. Almost tempted to do that. And the only reason is because I just enjoyed the old game, the original game, so much. It'd be very nostalgic. Damn it, I didn't see him. Damn pig. Ow, that hurt. But, as bad as that was, we have meat. We have leather. Uh, yep, leather. Whatever. <laughs> so we can make bacon and eggs. I was just getting the corn. I don't know. I think these... Yeah, I don't think you can do anything with these. Yeah, it's just that. But the green ones... Now that... Those are good. That one's... I don't think that one's been going yet. Oh, it's corn. There was a time when you could just pick the daggone things and get as much corn as you wanted to. It's not like that. There's a lot of things that have changed. And what's strange is... This is one of the things I do not like about this current version, but look at the corn. Does that look like corn to you? Looks like a piece of leather. It used to look like what you were eating. Now they all, all food looks like that. I just don't quite understand why they did it that way. How is that an improvement? I don't know. Yeah, there's some things about the old alphas. I mean, Honestly, guys, let me know. Would you like to see an old one be done again? Just to see what it was like? It was really entertaining to see some of the things that they had thought about doing, and then they never came through on it, though. I don't know. I hate when that happens. Well, I'm gonna have to get back the working stiff tools. I'm gonna have to get back and get some food. I don't think there's gonna be enough time to find some ammo. I really wish I could get more ammo than this. <laughs> ah, shoot. Oh, God. Got two of them. Kidding me? Uh, that was not exactly very fair. <laughs> that sucks. Two dogs and a bird attacked me. A 
Apparently I'm infected now. Great. I don't think I have any honey either. I'm almost certain of it. How much food does a blueberry pie give me? Plenty. In fact, that'll probably keep me fed for a little while. Fatigued. I'm not sure what that's supposed to do. Yeah, I got lumberjack armor. From what I understand, lumberjack armor is what they call a niche type armor. Yeah, all the armors have different different aspects to them, and they give you different buffs. When you have full sets, they give you an even bigger buff. It's all very complicated, but it, I'm starting to learn about it a little bit. I'm thirsty again, too. God. I'm going to start out the horde thirsty and hungry and infected. Now, I don't think that's a regular storm. I think that's just the build up for what's to come. Painkillers. Yeah, I'm going to hold on to that. Grab some water. Might grab a beer. Beer makes you fight better. That might come in handy. Let's see here. Medical supplies. I do have honey. Thank goodness. Do have honey. What is port bites? I forget. Damage mitigation. May not be a bad idea to have one of these too. And a vitamin. That might fix my fatigue. Yep, it did. Good. Good, good, good. Might not be a bad idea to grab some steroid here, too. I think the recog allows you to do range damage. That could come in handy as well. Yeah, see the skies already get pink. Now well, we need to head on over. We don't want them damaging our main base. I'll just leave the block there for now, because honestly. Ain't gonna do us any good right now. Help me as far as my Yep, I better get there. First, let's make sure I have this out because if I get jumped. Okay. Try not to run into any dog hordes, or any pigs. As hard as it is to get up here. Okay, what I'm going to do is pick that up. That's why we have it like that. I don't think they can reach that, so we should be all right. All right, we have 
some stuff here that we can deal with. I'm gonna scrap that. Can't sell it. Got some feathers to make some more arrows if we need to. We got plenty of arrows. Short arm pipe in case we need to make repairs. Here. Plenty of water. Steroids. Pain pills. Food. Let's get everything loaded up here. Let's see, we got iron arrows loaded. Shotgun shells. We are ready to rock and roll. I think this is going to be more about survival, guys, honestly, than it is going to be about winning. We just want to get through the night. That's all we want to do. Oh, shit. Didn't realize we had these pains in the butt. Actually, this might be a better spot to be. We are seriously up high. We can go even higher if we want to. I think what we're going to do is I'm going to stop Go ahead and grab all the ammo. We've got everything on our person now, so... If we do die... I don't think we're gonna die. I don't think they can get to us. And if they do, we can block this and go up. There shouldn't be any birds in this first horde. We got about an hour. And then all, all hell breaks loose. Well, we are not doing too bad, guys. I don't think they can get up here. I really don't. Which I've been surprised before, <laughs> so I'm not going to hold my breath on that. Let me see here. Grab this block. Make it a little bit more difficult for him.
They have to get through that. They have to actually make it to the ladder, and they have to get through the wood blocks before they can get up here. But it is getting ugly. Well, we're going to wait here just a little bit longer, and when the screen comes out, I'll bring it back. All right, guys, it's almost howdy doody time. Gonna be interesting to see how this plays out. I think my next horde base is actually going to be. There it is. I think I'm gonna try to go online and try to. Here they come. They're coming from the west. Wow, look at them all. Oh, the music's a lot more intense. can't pound on any one of them, any part of it too much. Might be very rather uneventful. I don't think they can get close enough to me. And as long as I keep moving, I'm keeping their attention off of myself. All right, guys, I'm going to the very top. Nothing's happening. I just thought I'd come up here and see what's up here, mostly. ammo but nothing I can use I don't have a, a blunderbuss we are high we are seriously high up here my problem with this is this is a little bit iffy as far as those railings I can't even get down into a little walking path. I'm actually standing on it. <laughs> yeah, things have been so far being pretty quiet. Definitely a high structure. Got that one.
การAlmost time, guys. We made it. That's it. Yeah, we got a 
clean house. I'm gonna get all the yeah, I put might get all the loot bags here. Let's see. Nine millimeters. Not bad. We didn't do bad at all. Got my stone arrows back. Ooh, they did take out one of the pillars. Look at that. But it held. Actually, they took out two of them. So it was... It was getting a little touchy there. A little touch and go. <laughs> that was fun. And played out very well. Damage the crack of crap out of that. Uh, yep, yeah, thirsty. Let's go ahead and use that. Ah. Nice try, dude. No banana. Close, but no banana. But yeah, we did it. We got through the first <laughs> blood moon. Now, then we can't use that again. That thing is beat up pretty doggone bad. And the next horde's gonna be a lot worse. Somehow or another, I got. One of them got me. I'm infected again, thank God. That just sucks. Well, let's head on back home. And load some of our loot. Alright, we did it. We survived. Didn't fall off the structure, didn't get eaten. It's all good. Anytime you survive a horde night, with everything intact is a good day, good thing. Gotta recheck this out. Well, I still have all kinds of stamina because of the steroids. Look at me go. Woo! <laughs> the thing is, I mean, I didn't get really hurt, but one of them infected me. All right, we're gonna start unloading some more stuff here. Anyway, guys, that is it. We made it. We survived. 
I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will be back with another episode. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. It sounds like we got some company. What is going on? Another dog board. What is going on? He's dead. One less dog horde. <laughs> After the last time, see, I can use the leather. Alright, guys, that was fun. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and harvest these guys up and add them to my collection. Anyway, guys, like I said, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like and subscribe and I'll be back with another episode of 7 Days to Die. So until then guys, as I always say, aim straight, cast far and have fun. I'll see you later. Bye bye. Don't let the sun set down on me. Don't let the sun sit down on me. No food or water, maybe seven days until I die. The bombs are falling, there was fire burning in the sky. The dead have risen.